Hello and welcome back. Math story 4 an outdoor class. The concept subtraction without borrow. Teacher Arjun has planned an outdoor class in which students will work in groups to complete the subtraction task. Students walk around the library, canteen, grounds, park and work on the task that has been assigned to them. Teacher Arjun took the attendance before letting the students out. There were 22 students present out of a total of 25 students. How many students were absent to the class? Let's calculate. Using the t-chart, let us write the facts towards the left. The total number of students equals 25. Number of students present to the class equals 22. Now the working towards the right side let us align the numbers according to their place value which is very important while adding and subtracting the numbers so ones and tens so 25 minus 22 gives us 3 therefore number of students absent to the class equals 3 the first team takes a look around the playground there were a total of 7 students playing after some discussion the team came up with the following question How many students were skating if there were 7 in total and 5 of them were playing on the ground? The 7 sticks are aligned out of which 5 are been cancelled. 7 minus 5 equals 2. Therefore, number of students playing skates equals 2. Team 2 is in charge of keeping an eye on the canteen. There were a total of 10 individuals in the canteen. How many people were standing out of the total 10 people if 5 are sitting? The team wondered as they discussed. Again by using the t-chart, total number of people in the canteen equals 10, number of people sitting in the canteen equals 5. You can also observe the 10 sticks aligned out of which 5 are been cancelled. Therefore, number of people standing in the canteen equals 5. 10 minus 5 gives us 5. In the library, team 3 noticed a small number of students. The library fee was paid by the student named Ronak. The team came up with the following question after watching this. If the library fee is rupees 300 and Ronak gave rupees 500, how much money will Ronak get back after paying the library fee? Total amount Ronak handed to the librarian equals rupees 500. Library fee equals rupees 300. So let us align the numbers according to their place values. Ones, tens, hundreds. So 500 minus 300 gives us 200. Therefore, amount Rona got back after paying library fee equals rupees 200. As said earlier, alignment is very important for calculations. The final team observes birds flying in the garden and comes up with this question after watching the birds. This time I would like you to check the answer and come up with your own question. Observe the given solution and frame your own question. I hope you enjoyed this story. For more stories keep watching. Thank you.